In ancient China, from the emperor to the scholastic officials, jian zhan or tea cup was used in the tea competition. The demand for teaware from the popular custom of tea fighting in the Northern Song Dynasty promoted the mass production of black glazed ware in jian killing. For a time, jian zhan became popular thanks to its shape and glazed color. Seen from the shape of the jian cup, its design of deep and slightly wide interior has its particular function. In addition, Compared with other teacups, jian cup has a thick embryo with more pores, so that great circumstances is created for keeping the water temperature. And this is an important factor for its outstanding status in tea fighting. With deep interior, the appropriate tea water level can be gained. For its glaze color, the black and shiny teacup served uh, as the best background for the various changes of the white soup flowers, which are caused by the different making temperature and tea quality. While the black of the teacup is a good foil to the white of tea soup. What is tea competition? It mainly includes three forms tea fighting, tea point creating, and tea opera acting. People in Song Dynasty used tea pot making method. The tea cake is crushed in the teacup with boiling water brewing and then fully heated hit with tea tools, stirring, making tea and water evenly mixed. Tea liquid becomes milky and because of stirring, the surface of tea soup presents a small white form, just like white flowers, which is called milk gathered surface. The tea liquid is very thick. The more powerful the blow, the tighter tea liquid would stick to the inner wall of the teacup, like lactose, which is called biting cup. This is the best tea soup. Tea biting sets the preparation, appreciation, imagination, and tasting of tea in one. In its outstanding Jian Jian tea cup, the fragrance of tea is refreshing. Color is pleasing to the eye, the taste is pleasing to the tongue, and the aftertaste is endless. The custom of tea competition promoted the back glades Jian Jian and it in turn pushed the art of tea biting to the peak.